My name is David Williams. I'm a trial lawyer with Allen & Allen. As a personal injury lawyer, one of the first questions my clients will ask me is, how do we determine the value of this case? I don't have a crystal ball, but I've been doing this long enough, and this firm has been doing this long enough, that I'm able to give my clients a pretty good range of a value on a case. The first thing I look at in evaluating a personal injury case is I look at the accident itself. How significant was this accident? Were there any aggravating circumstances, like was the other person drunk? Uh, were they texting or on their phone? I will look at the venue for the case, meaning where the accident took place and what have other juries done with similar facts in making an award. Another factor I look at in evaluating a personal injury claim is the injury, the nature of the injury and the significance of the injury. How extensive was the medical treatment? How long did it take for that medical treatment to get my client back to where they were the day before this accident, if they ever do? What was the status of their health just before this crash, and how did this accident affect that health? The amount of insurance coverage that's available to compensate my client is also an important factor. A